NFL free agency has been so insane that it feels good to have a little bit of normalcy back in my life. And by that, I mean the sugar rush, the Easter promo. This is very palatable for my monkey brain. And most importantly for my monkey brain is this, the Easter egg promo. Now, I ask you to take every single grain of salt in your home and throw it at this promo. What? It was a really stupid way of saying that analogy, but if you guys remember the Christmas promo this year, the Christmas promo has these mystery presents. You can spend a lot of coins trying to collect all of them, and I gotta say, the Christmas promo this year in Madden was absolutely horrendous. I don't wanna rain on the parade that is the Easter promo because historically, the Easter promo has always been so much better than the Christmas promo in terms of the Easter eggs. These mystery Easter eggs are the exact same thing as mystery Christmas presents. It's just that the Christmas promo was so underwhelming that I am nervous about this. Now ask yourself, do you really think that's gonna stop me from collecting every single random mystery egg? No, it's not gonna stop shit. I'm still gonna open every single one of these. I will spend all 14 million coins if I have to, and I'm ready to get hurt again. I've made this analogy before, but it's basically like drafting Kyle Pitts in fantasy football. Are you ready to get hurt again? No question about it. Cause I am. I'm drafting that motherfucker. He's got Kirk Cousins now. There's no job. Manu Smith! Whatever, I'm coping. Now, on a real note, super excited about the Sugar Rush promo. The first ever Gold 99 limited available player. That's actually not true. I think Super Bowl Mahomes was a limited available player, but there may actually be some merit to the rerolls. The rerolls are an 89 plus overall Sugar Rush player. I'm gonna open one right now because I just want to see the animation. Mm. It's cool, it's clean. I don't know, man. I think some of the animation in the past have been better. Regardless, let's talk about this promo and the players that are available right now. And of course, the big boy, what we're looking for today. Oh shoot, there's actually two limiteds. I didn't even know that. Turns out there's a Leonard Williams limited. Gold 99 as well, limited. Sugar Rush Leonard Williams. 99 block shed, 99 power moves, 88 speed. Damn, he's honestly pretty cheap. So that tells me that a lot of people are pulling him. So that's really good news. But the real one, that we're looking for, rest in peace, Demarius Thomas. Demarius Thomas passed away two years ago, way too young. So respect to EA for honoring him. And hopefully we can pull this card and honor him as well with an insane game. Gold 99, Demarius Thomas, limited 6'3", 230, insane stats, 99 short route running, 98 spectacular catch. This card looks nasty. That's what we're looking for today. There are also some set 98 overalls. I'm not too impressed with them, to be honest. There's a Stafford, there's a Nico Collins, who I'm excited about, Barmore, Marshawn Ladd, more always gets an Easter card. And those are the 498s. And then there's the two gold 99 limited. So really right now it's Demarius Thomas or Leonard Williams. Not too excited about the 98s. But here's one more thing I want to say. If you're still playing Madden Ultimate Team and you're interested in collecting these mystery Easter eggs, please, for the love of God, do not buy them right now. We had the same conundrum for the Christmas promo. In the Christmas promo, I was shelling out all my money to collect Christmas presents. And then like two days before Christmas, they dropped an extra excellent offer. I think it was like 10 bucks and you get all the Christmas presents, which completely devalued all the work I did beforehand. So wait is all I'm saying. Be patient and see if there's going to be a better offer for these eggs because I wouldn't be shocked at all if there is. All right. I apologize. Yap session is over. Finally. You get the idea. There are random mystery Easter eggs that will hatch on Easter, which I'm so excited to see. There's two gold 99 limiteds. Let's start opening some packs. The pack I'm going to open is this ladder up pack. And on the 89 plus, I get a 92 Jonah Williams. Good start. The next ladder step is three times 92 plus. Let's make sure we're checking these odds. So you got a 3% chance at a 98 overall better. It's just not good, but a 10% at a 95 plus. Let's hit those 3% odds. Why not, bro? Jamin Davis. Oh, no fucking shot. Are you kidding? Me. <laughs> Dude, there's no shot. Dude, my Hawaii odds are fucking cracked. I just started. Dude, I'm telling you, there is no way Leonard Williams should be this cheap because he's so good. That just means that, yeah, fuck, you can pull this thing. Leonard Williams, you are the first gold 99 to ever be pulled on the pack and play squad. 88 speed, 99 block shed, 99 power moves. This is the first ever gold 99 on the pack and play squad. I'm not gonna lie, boys. It's been a while since I've played on the pack and play squad. I don't even remember what's on this team anymore. I actually don't. Oh, we get Quentin Johnston, wide receiver one for the Chargers. Okay, I'm gonna be totally honest with you. 
with you. If I was not a YouTuber, I would quit right now. Dude, I am so far ahead. If this happens to you guys, you get a limited like this. Stop pulling. It's only downhill from there. Regardless, I'm a gambling degenerate. Underdog fantasy, by the way. Code MMG, they'll double your first deposit up to $100. Yes, I am cheating on prize picks. I signed a new deal with Underdog. It's for two years long. So get used to the sellout. Luke Godic, 95 overall, heater. So, the, oh, Nelson Aguilar. Jeez, you got a 95? They're just handing these fuckers out to anybody. I want to see the big Sugar Rush animation because I pulled a limited. I haven't seen it yet. The 98 overalls are going to be the ones that actually have the big animation. Damn. 395s. They are really good, though. Those are really good 95s in good positions. Wide receiver, left end, and right tackle. Uh, and then it looks like the final piece of this ladder is a fucking opportunity pack. Of course it is. It's two extravagant baskets and one 92 or 98 plus overall Sugar Rush player. So this is going to get me one random extravagant egg or better. Ah, so it is just like the Christmas promo. The, the question is, are the limiteds going to be good players or not? That is what will determine if this is actually, like if this is a valuable promo or not, because they fucked us in Christmas. All right, let's start with the extravagant basket. Can I see a limited egg out the gates? Ooh. So this, I'll tell you right now, this is not a limited crazy egg. What's interesting though, is this is very descriptive. It's a wild card egg, so obviously it's a weekly wild card. Honestly, the fact that I'm seeing this tells me that they acknowledged how pissed off people were in the Christmas promo. So they're just blatantly telling you what's in it. I don't know if I like that. Hey, EA, instead of just blatantly telling us, you could just increase the pack odds. No. Second, whoa, oh, 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 oh my God, I fucking cracked. It's Brian Branch, it's Brian Branch. Those are Detroit Lions colors, it says Branch out. It's a gold 99 Brian Branch. It's a limited egg, opens on the 31st, be sure. <laughs> Dude, am I just am I just out of my fucking mind or what? I just pulled Leonard Williams in a limited egg out of like six packs. Now, remember, the best way to tell the value of something is to check the quick sell value. This quick sells for 9,560 chocolates, right? If we go over to the chocolate shop, the cost of an extravagant egg is 4,900. So that is double the value of the basket itself. That is a it's a spectacular poll. No way I get Demarius Thomas here, right? It's a 92 or a 98 plus. Don't tell me this is Demarius Thomas. Oh, it's a 98 though. Boom! <laughs> whoa, 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 yeah. hey, hey. Dude, what are we on right now? I'm dude, this Nico Collins is insane on his own. 99 jump, 6'4, 98 speed, 99 spec. This is a jump ball maniac. And of course, he's a 98 overall, so he's gonna get some crazy good discount abilities. Give me deep out elite. <sighs> Okay. Brown tech for one is excellent. And then this is, this man was built for double me. Yeah, th I'm far ahead. I'm not opening another pack. I'll tell you what, you're not going to see another Sugar Rush pack opening from me until they drop a really good offer. And I promise they will. It's going to be two days before the 31st or like maybe three days before they're going to drop some excellent offer. Regardless, let's go look at the pack and play team. I don't even know what my team consists of right now. All right, here's the pack and play squad right now. I know this isn't even right. Who cares, guys? We're going to fucking ball out, right? Nico Collins is now wide receiver one. And then the home Homie, we didn't check yet. Leonard Williams. So what are you rocking? No outsiders, Mr. Big Stop and Edge. Threat a lead for one. I haven't seen that in a long time. Under pressure, unpredictable. This is interesting. I think you go no outsiders. Super good ability this year. Take unpredictable for free. And there's really no reason to run anything else. Gosh, that is a good card. No outsiders, unpredictable for zero AP. There was once a point in time where pack and play had rules. That's just fucking anarchy. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna buy Demarius Thomas. I'll sell him after the episode. He he technically can't be on the team because I didn't pull him. You know, I'll be honest. I don't think any of you are keeping a spreadsheet. So let's just play ball. Demarius Thomas, gold 99. Does he get special abilities? I assume not. Can still rock double me. So Demarius Thomas and Nico Collins. He gets red zone threat mid out elite and mid in elite. Ooh, for zero AP, you get improved catching on all medium passes. That's sick. All right, gentlemen, let's have some fun. Did they give us a house rules for Easter? Bon, bon, bonanza. Can you make it through this bonanza to the playoffs both players get seven downs what okay you get seven downs and you rack up points based on how big of plays you make all right so it looks like we have to chuck absolute piss missiles what if we just go demarius thomas to the end zone and we'll have aj brown on a corner route as kind of a safety valve here let's check this out ah uh, fuck it i'm throwing it oh my god is that doable oh oh my 
my God, he had him. We're going to go with a little post corner over here. So Collins got the post. Demarius Thomas got the corner. Who wants it more? Demarius Thomas wants it more. Demarius Thomas. How many points do I get for this shit? I don't know how this game works. Hey, hey. <laughs> Broke the tackle just to be a dick. Oh, and he's gone. That's a free win. Nice job, Demarius. The servers cannot process this W. All right, Madden head to head is tweaking balls. So let's let's believe our way through this. Starting out on defense. So I think you get seven straight plays. So he's going to get seven straight plays to rack up as many points as he can by getting. Thank you. <laughs> I don't get anything for that, though. It doesn't matter. So he gets points by having... Oh, you don't get seven straight. I somehow have the ball now. Okay, I don't know shit, gentlemen. Maybe we alternate. I don't I don't know. I do know that if I get 10 plus yards, I get points. And I just got a flag for calling two audibles. Are you shitting me? I'm going to lose the ball now. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. Settle down, Matt. Somehow Demarius is not in on this route combo. I'm going to hit a Koye. I'm going to hit the Nigerian Nightmare. So that should give me some points. Okay, I get a point for that. Just going to hit McCaffrey. I'll take a few... Oh! Maybe a little bit more if you want to break some tackles. I'm going to go with Koye again. Dude, he can't stop that route. Koye breaks a tackle. That's my, that's the Nigerian nightmare, boy. Wonder if I could get McCaffrey over the middle here. Yep. <laughs> that is the most frustrating thing about Madden 24. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That wigged me out. I can't let him score. I can't let him score. Good. Huge. Honestly, I don't know how he only got one point for that. That was a huge play. But we saved ourselves from getting scored on, which definitely saved us some points. So that's really good. Damn. Fourth and goal. He has seven plays to get in the end zone. Does he run this? Does he run this? Let's blow it up with Ronnie Lott. Let's blow it up. No, it's a pass. Same guy. Same guy. Same guy. <laughs> Oh, he played defense on himself. His own wide receiver busted that up. Sixth and goal. You ever seen that before? Oh, good ball. Y'all poo. I respect it. I think he's going to try the same thing. I just got to fly to the halfback because this is what he wants. Hey, didn't matter. Couldn't get it off. It's eight to eight. And now we're back on offense. When does the game end? How long does this go on for? I feel like knowing the answer to that is probably pretty important, but I just, I can't find the answer right now. That's a bad ball. It's not a bad ball, it's a great ball. Any jump ball to Nico Collins is probably actually a pretty good pass considering how ridiculous he is. All right, second and goal. What do we think about just a Demarius Thomas Hail Mary? Don't need to Hail Mary it, could just do that. Ooh. Oh, oh, Jesus. Have a little respect for the guy. Oh wait, the game's over when the clock runs out, obviously. I knew that. Taking the sh- Insane. I just got lurked off of a dog shit pass and we hit stuck him. Oh my God, that reset the downs. Wait, I'm back on first and goal now. Oh shit. Okay, I suck. I don't know what I'm throwing right now, but all right, we got a third and goal here. I'm gonna hit the dig in the middle to Nico Collins. Nico Collins been a big impact here. Step up, Mahomes. Get behind the user. Don't fumble. Don't fumble. Look at the push. All right, we're, we're rocking a fifth and goal here. Everybody knows that classic scenario. Now we're rocking a sixth and goal. Burn as much clock and don't let him get in the end zone. We'll be all right here. I'm gonna take the check down. I'm gonna take this to Nico Collins, set up seventh and goal. So this is my final play. I gotta go end zone here. If I get end zone, it's ball game. Do have Jameer Gibbs. Jameer, gotta get in there. Jameer, get in there! <gasps> oh, the gates are open. He got to the one. All right, we got a five point lead. Every time he gets 10 yards, he gets another point. He gets a touchdown. He obviously wins the game, right? We know this, we know this. He is passing. He's almost throwing an interception. Second and 99. God, this is... Have you ever in your life seen that before? Have you ever seen second and 99 before? I have to imagine it's your first time. Third and 99 once again. Does he take a short check down? No, he wants it all. How are we not intercepting this gentleman? Fourth and 99. And... Oh, no. Fifth and 92. This game is not over. Gentlemen, it's not over. He could get in the end zone somehow. No. No! Wait a second. I kind of got to let him score, right? That's insane. The game is not over. Wait a second, but I still think I have a chance now. The only problem is if I don't get out of bounds, I kind of lose. Giving AJ Brown a chance, baby. That's not cool, man. That's not cool to let me go out like that. I have to post this on YouTube.com. You can't do this to me.
All right, gentlemen, and Madden servers are down once again, so that, I have to end on that. That's brutal. All right, my luck ran dry, but hey, I had my I had my luck for the packs, and that's what's important. All right, boys, hey, I love you. Short one today, but insane pack opening and awesome gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was a blast. I love you. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.